We were watching uh, live surgery. Uh, there was a case of uh, partial nephrectomy with the uh, uh, new Da Vinci robot. It was uh, very impressive. The, it was uh, good to see that everybody uh, had uh, 3D uh, uh, glasses on. It was, uh, well, very nice surgery. Uh, I was watching uh, one of the live surgeries, uh, robotic partial nephrectomy. Uh, particularly, I was interested, they were using the, the newest uh, platform for the robotic surgery, the Da Vinci XI. Well, this live surgery, they presented a couple of cases uh, that are of great interest for uh, urologists all over the world. That is uh, reconstruction of uh, female disorders in the, in the deep pelvis, right, and uh, incontinence surgery. And they uh, cut out a renal tumor uh, in, in the kidney. Uh, I learned that you can operate with the robot very uh, easy. It's, it's, it's a very clean procedure. It uh, looks uh, oncologically safe. Uh, well, I'm looking forward to uh, do the same uh, procedure in my uh, own country. It's when you watch people doing procedures that you do yourself, you always get uh, some uh, practical hints, tips and tricks as you, as you look at people and, and that work on a very high level and uh, that uh, do maybe uh, procedures a little bit different from, from, from your uh, style of doing it. It's, it's helpful to see um, the surgery in 3D, you kind of get a kind of maybe more detail. Uh, it's, it's very good that you can interact with the uh, surgeon, that you can ask uh, questions and that you can uh, learn the little uh, tricks which are very important to, to do the surgery uh, correctly. Congress of this size or con convention of this size has to do this nowadays because urology is, is a practical uh, fashion, a practical subject and it's a hand, you, you have a hands-on approach uh, during 30 to 50 percent of your work time so it's uh, very important uh, uh, to use visual communication and, and uh, to enhance skills.